Hello student, how are you doing? Welcome back with term 2. In today's lesson, we are going to discuss about the application of integration. So we have uh, to use uh, integration in the calculation of area bound by curves. We discuss how to use integration in the calculation of volume of solid for evolution. Then finally, we will see how to use integration in the calculation of archives. So let's start with a uh, calculation of area bounded by curves. So the area of the region bounded by the curve of the function fx x axis and the line is x equal to a, x equal to b is given by the formula. Area is equal to integral from a to b, then fx dx. So basically, this is the formula we use when you are looking for the area bounded by the graph of function and uh, the line is x equal to a, x equal to b. Here we have the graph which we can use to explain the formula, right? So we have uh, the graph of a function fx. We have line is x equal to a, x equal to b, and then this is our region. This is the shaded region, right? So, we are interested in knowing the area included between the graph of this function, the is x equal to a is equal to b. So, the formula is here, right? We can use it. So, this shows uh, the shaded region, and this is the power function. This is our lower limit of integration, and this is our upper limit of integration. So, when calculating the area under the curve of a function fx, we follow the steps below. Number one, you have to sketch the area. Then, we have to look for the boundaries A and B. We have to set up the definite integral and then we integrate. So, we are going to do example number one. So example number one is very simple. Let's discuss how we can do it. So let's find the area bounded by the graph of a function f x is equal to 2x plus 1. x axis line is between x equal to 0 and x equal to 1. As you can see, first of all, we have a look for the graph of this function. It is a straight line. It is very simple. Uh, after having the graph of that function, we have to check the region. Our region. We start from x equal to 0 up to x equal to 1. This is our region. So, when we are done, we use the formula. The formula is very simple. We simply take uh, the integral from 0 up to 1. Our function is 2x plus 1. Then it is x. You all know how to integrate this. It is very simple, right? So, this will be 2x squared over 2 plus x, then from 0 up to 1. We are going to do the fundamental theorem of integral calculus. You all know that. So uh, the area will be equal to 2 1 squared over 2 plus 1, then minus Everything here will be zero. There is no need. So uh, our area will be equal to uh, after simplifying, we will be having one plus one. Then area is equal to two. Then square unit. Basically, this will be the area for 
this uh, example number one. We are going to do another example. Example number two. Calculate the area of the region included between the graph of function f x is equal to x squared from x equal to 0 up to x equal to 2 as you can see we have here uh, the function which is a parabola and you have the lower limit which is 0 and our upper limit is 2 So what we are going to do, we are going to make a rough sketch of this parabola. It is turning upwards. And you have to, to shape the region. We start from zero up to two. Then you have to shape the region. So uh, we are going to apply the formula. The area of this region will be equal to the integral from 0 up to 2, then x squared then dx. So after integrating this, we have x power 3 over 3. Then we have to put our lower limit, which is 0. Our upper limit is 2. So the area will be equal to uh, 2 power 3 over 3 minus 0. So our area will be equal to 8 over 3. Then you put here square limit. Let's do example number 3 and then I give you what I'm going to try. Find the area of the region included between a graph of the function fx which is equal to x power 2 plus 2 then from x equal to 1 up to x equal to 5 as you can see the graph of this function will be the parabola be a parabola, right? And when x is equal to 0, y is equal to 2 here. So it will be uh, turning upwards from uh, the point 0, 2. And uh, our lower limit is 1. Let's consider that uh, our upper limit is here, 5. Then this is our region. Then the area of this part, this shaded region, area is equal to the integration from 1 up to 5. Then our function is uh, x squared plus 2. Of course, this is our parabola. Then dx. The 
So we simply uh, integrate as usual. The integration of x squared plus 2 will be equal to x power 3 over 3 plus 2 x. Then our lower limit is 1, our upper limit is 5. Then we are going to apply the fundamental formula. Area will be equal to 5 power 3 over 3 plus 2 times the 5 then minus 1 over 3 plus 2 so area will be equal to uh, 5 power 3 is equal to 125 over 3 plus 10 minus 1 over 3 minus 2 so our area will be equal to 125 over 3 minus 1 over 3 then 10 minus 2 is equal to 8 so uh, here our area will be equal to 124 over 3 plus 8. So when we do the LCM here, the final answer will be equal to 124 plus 24 over 3, which will be equal to uh, 148 over 3. If you want, you can use your calculator and then you simplify, right? So basically, the final answer will be 148 over 3, then you put here square units. Thank you very much.